Hey YouTube, what the crap is going on? It's Lardo here. And boy, have I got a treat for you. We've got Great Britain on one side. The gigantic army. Look at how big this army is. Um... So, I'm going to zoom up and see. We've got our um, African Native Infantry here, in their red coats. Look pretty darn cool. Um, then we've got my um, Footline Infantry. Ton of them. Let me sure to bring a lot of line infantry. The colonial line infantry, they just look amazing. Look at those red suits. Look amazing. This is one of the reasons I love Great Britain. They've got a uh, great suits. Well, it's such a gloomy day, I just kind of got that little gloomy feel to it. And then here we have the opposing side, which is, of course, Spain. Who are looking very, very cool. Um, I was kind of trying to go for a Spanish War of Succession feel here, kind of a uh, Spanish versus British um, thing going here. Um, and for those of you who are wondering what mod I'm using, I am using Darth Mod. And it, it works on uh, campaign, online battles, regular battles. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful mod that enhances Empire Total War. Um, and I know it's an old game, but just something about it. Uh, really inspires me to keep coming back to it. Okay, here comes the French cavalry. Boom. Perfect line shot. Already breaking. You can just hear like the cavalry background cannons. Ah, uh, nice charger, nice charger. Right into the infantry. But my infantry will easily take care of that. And look, they're already breaking. Got the Spanish line infantry moving up. We got my guys moving up too. I formed squares there just to make sure that they don't. Ah. Uh, yes. Some more cavalry. Here we go. Ready? Fire. Seven arrow fire. Thorough fire. Oh, looks so cool. Okay, here we go. Volley, maybe? Volley? No? Oh, wait, here we go. They're loading up the gun. Boom. Wonderful volley. Here comes the Spanish. I think they're going for a charge here. And, uh, for those of you who are wondering, um... I'm going to be posting videos mostly on the weekends, um, but to certain technical, technical difficulties I wasn't able to post this weekend. Oh, look at that beautiful cavalry charge with it. Wow. There you go, fighting. I'm definitely going to win this engagement, though. <clears throat> Here we go. The battle has begun officially, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to swing my uh, African infantry around for a uh, flanking maneuver. Um, but 
And then I kind of had um, some more infantry take care of the uh, Spanish infantry coming from my right. So I can move them over. They just look so cool marching. So I'm kind of trying to surround them here. Cut their, uh, cut their entire army in half. Perfect volley. Um, if you guys want to see any screenshots or anything, uh, just go out um, and check out my Facebook channel. I mean, my Facebook page, my channel, whatever you want to call it. Um, and make sure to check out my Twitch. Um, and I'll always happily play with you on my Steam. So, uh, for those of you who um, are new to my channel, um, because I am a relatively new channel, of course. Um, I do a wide variety of pretty much any game that you guys want me to play. Um, Total War is just one of my favorite games. But I also do play like GTA, Black Ops, Destiny. Oh, look at that perfect charge right there. Cavalry versus infantry. Yeah, my other infantry kind of. They're firing. There you go. My men kind of broke there. My uh, African troops, if you look like her. And here come. Here we go. Ready? Aim. Fire. Ready? And fire. Look at that smoke coming. It looks just so cool. Still got my cannons back here, um, kind of holding it down. Um, but I don't use my cannons too much in games, you'll notice, because um, I find that they hit my infantry a lot, which causes a lot of friendly fire for me. Um, which is not so good for me. And um, yeah, for those of you who are wondering, I'm also using a sound mod, uh, a rifle sound mod. It um, makes the musket sound more realistic. Um, if you guys want me to do like a campaign on like, Great Britain, Austria, Spain, whatever you guys want me to do a great campaign on, uh, I mean grand campaign on, I want to do. You can kind of see on the mini map above, um, kind of like the right and left are kind of, uh, more spread out, and then the center is just like a big, uh, just a big melee fight. This looks amazing. You got a little um, melee fight going on there in the middle, um, and then the Spanish are kind of moving around and trying to flank them from both sides. Um, um, we are kind of breaking a lot, um, some of my men, but, um, I feel like I'm doing pretty well. Uh, again, I have the AI on, uh, hard, because very hard is, uh, kind of cheating. Um, it lets, uh, regular... Um, infantry and guards be beat up by um, armed citizenry, which is kind of silly. Man, look at all the dead on the ground, which is crazy. Little big brawl there, though. Still going on. I'm gonna go silence the uh, the there. 
with my dragoons. I'm gonna go for a cavalry charge right here into their infantry, kind of uh, tie them down. They're breaking, so that works out for me. Um, look, the Spanish are just firing everywhere. Such an intense battle. Um, they're rotating their cavalry. They're using they're very they're using their dragoons very well. Sorry, English is hard for me today. Here we go. Right into the fray. Uh, speaking of which, if you guys want me to do any Game of Thrones uh, battles and things, theme scenarios, um, I love those. Especially with the uh, Westeros mod for Medieval 2. And there are a lot of new Game of Thrones mods coming out because uh, Season 6 just ended. Um, like the Seven Kingdoms mod, I saw uh, like Pixelate Apollo, Jackie Fish. They're doing a lot of those, so um, if you guys want me to do that, um, I will try to get the mod for you guys. And play it, maybe. There we go. Dragoons versus uh, line infantry. Should probably be uh, winning there. And then, um, I pretty much won the battle. Um, I'm just kind of trying to um, mop up a little, I guess you could say. Here I go with my infantry. Use the cavalry to silence them, and that's from the musket fighting. Should go well for me. Um, their cannons really devastated me in this battle. Um, but I feel like at the end of the day, um, we were able to push them back. Um, it's kind of just their cavalry now remaining. Not so much your infantry. And if you look back a lot, my ratting troops kind of returned to the fight. There you go. They're uh, dragoons, I believe, charging into um, some of my infantry there in the background. And boom, perfect musket volley there. But I'm going to counter them with some of my dragoons. Um, and the general unit, rather. Fighting, bravely. Not gonna let them win. Um, and we also have kind of the little line infantry battle going here. I mean, not a little big line infantry battle going on here between my men and the Spanish. So, um, I've always been a big fan of the Spanish War Succession, so, um, I'm probably gonna be doing a lot of Spanish War Succession and Austrian War Succession kind of theme battles. Um, but if you guys want me to do any other theme battles, let me know. I will be posting a GTA video soon. So, if you guys are looking forward to that, um... And then doing some of that. Oh, right into their backs. Perfect line of charge. Only the bridge can deliver that kind of line of charge. Breaks them instantly. Amazing. So, um, we've kind of cleaned up the, uh, the right center. Ah. Oh. That looks pretty cool. Ah, oh, I'm just kind of trying to finish off the last thing. Yeah. Returning men and remaining men with the Spanish hat. Here they come. That's kind of how I feel to be one of them. 
Oh man, I'd be so scared if I was one of these guys. Kind of be in the back, like, oh hey everyone, you're doing great. Don't give up. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't be in the front. Someone smoke on the battlefield, along with the fog. And the cannon fire really adds to like the uh, kind of scary, not scary, but uh, cool effect of it. So yeah, guys, that's the video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Peace out.